Hi, I'm Fabrice Di Giulio, Dynamic CRM MVP. My speaking session uh, this year during the ESPC will be about advanced scenarios uh, about integrating Dynamic CRM, SharePoint Online, and Yammer to take benefits from each of the solution. This short how-to video will just cover the premises. Uh, how can you easily integrate Dynamic CRM and SharePoint to enable document management features very easily with the native tools uh, offered by Dynamic CRM. So this is very, very easy to, to execute. First, you will have to connect to Dynamic CRM. So when you basically connect to Dynamic CRM so for the first time, you will be prompt with some helpers appearing in yellow bars on the top of the user interface um, to add rules to your user, to download the Outlook, the, uh, the CRM Outlook plugin, and also to en enable server-side document management. If you don't have this helper, you can go to settings, document management here, and click on document management settings. The main difference, basically, between Dynamic CRM and SharePoint is the kind of data that you will have. While Dynamic CRM is completely a structured data model, SharePoint, at the opposite, is completely unstructured. So connecting Dynamic CRM to SharePoint will also rely on this assumption how, uh, how can I have structured data, the same structured data in the SharePoint side? In this wizard, you will be uh, prompt to select the different entities that you want to have synced in SharePoint. So you have four default selections, which are accounts, cases, notes, and opportunities. But you have also a lot of entities, all the, the default entities of Dynamic CRM that can be completely integrated. In the URL field, you just have to specify the URL to the website in which you want the data to be synchronized. Then clicking on Next, you can select a data structure. So this screen mentions folder structure, but depending on the node that you target in SharePoint, you can generate folders or document libraries. So based on my account entity, I will generate a model which will be derivating from here. So first I will have one document labor, a library per account. Uh, and in this document library, this account document library, uh, I then will be able to configure the different opportunities, etc. And same for all the different opportunities that I selected in the previous screen. So clicking on next, my wizard will create automatically the different document libraries. So because the uh, environment is completely empty, this is very fast here and then I will click on finished. That's all done for the default dynamic CRM part. Of course, in advanced scenarios, you will have a more detailed specification to, to define. On the SharePoint side here, I have my site content, which uh, is now updated with the different document libraries that I just created. So the cases, accounts, notes, and opportunities. I'm doing the translation because the environment uh, is still in French, but this will be translated for the final speech. Now this is integrated. I have my link configured between Dynamics CRM and SharePoint. So the next part that will be covered during my speaking session will be how can I configure my different entities to have a complete synchronized connection. So the main purpose will be if I'm uploading a document in Dynamics CRM, how can I be sure that this document will be managed within SharePoint? 
And if I don't have access as a user to Dynamics CRM, how can I collaborate on documents which are originally managed from Dynamics CRM? And then uh, another option should be to have uh, an added business value with the specific app developments covering a business aspect of this synchronization. So we can imagine a solution targeting, I don't know, maybe the IT support teams that will be able to browse from a Windows 10 application, all the cases, the open cases for one account, and then manage all the documentation directly from an interface completely disconnected from SharePoint and Dynamics CRM. That will be the subject uh, during my speaking session. So hope to see you there.